President Mohamed Buhari says achieving the SDGs in Africa will mean ending poverty and hunger, safeguarding the ecosystem and the planet, and ensuring that people live in peace and prosperity by the year 2030. The President stated this in New York at a strategic high-level ev event to mark uh, the official launch of the Nigeria Integrated National Financing Framework Report on Sustainable Development, NIFF, on the sidelines of the 77th United Nations General Assembly. Stressing the importance placed by the present administration on achieving the objectives, President Buhari said it was pertinent to a state that achieving inclusive, broad-based and sustainable development was a cardinal objective of his administration. He then expressed the delight at the process leading to the NIFF, which started in 2020, finally crystallized into Friday's memorable activity. Despite the challenges posed by the sharp drop in the prices of crude oil and the coronavirus pandemic, Nigeria has remained resolute in our genuine desire to maintain and grow our economy. The 2017 to 2020 economic recovery and growth plan, the 2020 economic sustainability plan, the 2021 national poverty reduction with growth strategy, and the 21 to 25 to 2025 national development are all aligned with the SDGs. It is aligned with this commitment and with a focus on the National Development Plan 2021 to 2025 that the Federal Government of Nigeria, with the support of the United Nations Development Program, has adopted the Integrated National Financing Framework as a tool to improve SDGs financing without increasing public debt and contingent liabilities to levels that will be detrimental to economic sustainability. The Integrity National Financing Framework financing strategy is backed by our medium-term revenue strategy and the medium-term expenditure framework. As Nigeria champions, the Integrity National Financing framework process. We hope to promote the strategic alignment of financial policies with sustainable development and provide the enabling conditions for domestic and international public and private financial actors to best respond to our national needs. Hello. Hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.